Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel, 18 Cross Trek Man, and I apologize for the loud noise. It is right next to the highway of the discount tire I'm at, so yes, it is loud. But I will try to talk as loud as possible so you can hear me. I'm going to get my wheels and tires installed. You could probably see the tires behind me. And for the tire, or, or I should say wheel reveal, I will show you right now. Bam, there they are, and you can see they are made by Method. They are the MR701s and 15 by 100 and they are 5 by 100 as that is our bolt pattern. So I'm very excited to get these on. These are the matte black. They also make them in bronze. Um, I did opt for these because these are the newer model that came out at the end of summer, which is going with the MR502s so that's been um, pretty popular, really dang popular. That was my actual wheel that I didn't want to get. But I thought I would change it up a bit. So that is my wheel selection. I'll show you it as soon as it is installed on the car. With, again, I have the Cooper, um, can't even remember, Cooper AT3 4S and 225 7015. So that is the tread pattern there. Um, also, we'll be installing these this is the lock i hope this fits i'm not really sure and then for the new nuts i got these spline ones also by muteki they are right here so these are the ones hopefully these will these will fit on the car i'm not really sure i just wanted something black as i heard the stock ones won't refit so not really sure but i did get this just in case so i could get this all installed and it looks like I did buy extra or I did buy the wheel cover caps for the wheels. Well, I'm looking in the box and it looks like it might actually come with them or it does. So I didn't need to order extra. All right, I'm just gonna go ahead and open the other two. I already opened three of them. And one had a little, little like overspray of paint or something, a bubble, but it was very, very minor. And I'll make that my spare, or I don't know, I guess uh, I would have to tell them when they install it. But I'm just gonna go ahead and open the other two up to see, make sure the condition looks good so you could just see another unboxing. Another sticker, I have too many of those. While I have the car all loaded up, I just want to show you the four tires fit like that in the back. Um, two on this side, two more on the other side, and then the fifth one just like that. And while we're at it, I happen to have a Jeep Cherokee. I think that might be like a competing model to the Crosstrek. So I'll just give you a quick look since it's right next to my car. Um, that is the rear of it and it looks like it sits a little bit taller um, and then I'll go to the side of round to I'll go around the Cherokee and if that's the model I think I'm not even sure but that is a uh, Cherokee so it definitely looks a little bit longer but I'm not 100% sure and then let's go see a front angle definitely like the look of the cross check better those three running day lamps, fog lamps, and headlights, I think they are. So fog lamps at the bottom, headlights in the center, and then the day lamps at the top is just, I don't know, not really a fan, it's kind of weird, but that is a front. And yeah, definitely it must be sitting a little bit higher. Well, put it this way, the body is taller because I believe the costume actually has more ground points when I'm looking at it. Um, going down. I believe there's more. I don't know the specs of this. So I think there is more ground clearance, but it's just a taller car. As you can see, the uh, side mirror is just a tad higher. So yeah. And it's done. And it looks really good. But it's hard to see because it's dark. So. Hey guys, so I'm back home and have it parked in the garage. I love the look. I love the look of these wheels. They look real good. And the head of the car looks a little bit higher. 
Um, but I'm going to add, I am having some trouble. And um, I say, can you hear it? And or do you hear it in the next clip? And you definitely can hear something's going on. Um, I'm not quite sure what it is. I've looked at this all around. And I know when you turn it all the way, it does rub on the inner part a little bit. Um, I know it's dark, I apologize. Um, but it's just going straight, you hear a noise. So if any of you guys know what that noise may be, please share. But when I go, uh, well, tomorrow morning, I'm going to go check it out and see if they could take a look and maybe they can um, identify where that noise is coming from. Um, but I think it looks really good. I did go with white lettering out. I want to try it, look. And I, I mean, I like it. I think it looks cool. I mean, I know some may think it's tacky or whatever, but I think I'm going to stick with it going forward, even when I have to get new tires. Um, but these are the wheels, the MR7, MR701, and I apologize, it is a little dark in here, but it is nighttime when they finished it up. So this is the final look. This is my combo. You hear that noise? 